because you drove the homeowners out of here. Flynn residents telling city council they've had enough. By not sending the police when they came and by raising the water so high, all the taxpayers left. I'm about the last one left on my block. Many concerned about proposed cuts to police and fire. When we talk about the reduction of 36 police officers, maybe 19 firefighters. They put out those high numbers, so when they only cut 20 police officers and maybe 10 firefighters, we think that we've had a victory. Council members acknowledging their shortcomings when it comes to changing the proposed budget. We all really have to really recognize what this is. And we, as a council, don't have that much authority to override what the emergency manager is. And I want to make sure that it's, that it's really plain for the residents to understand. One of the main changes being considered by the emergency manager addresses funding for police. We um, look to take uh, $1.8 million in the, in the um, general fund budget. Um, to redirect that to public safety. There are several other small changes council members recommended, like changing the hours of the city lockup and eliminating funding for the Human Relations Commission. We went through the budget with a fine tooth comb and we came up with some funds, but now it's up to the EM and the powers that being to leave that money where we found it. 